Hello everyone, I am Defudge3004. Welcome back to 7 Days to Die. Thank you for taking the time to hang out with me. I always enjoy having you here. So sit back, relax, enjoy the video. Let's get into some gaming. We just got our mini bike. We got that as a reward on our last mission. There were some other things to do and, you know, to accept. But that's one thing that I wanted. It was motorcycle parts, but we can't make that yet because we haven't opened enough books yet, but soon. And we have to go over there and go see about doing that mission. So we have this now. This is going to help out a lot. It is actually really good. It's relatively fast. And we don't run out of stamina when we have to use it. We need to go over to the mortician's house and see about doing a mission there. I am not too sure exactly where it is that we have to go but i do know it's the mortician's house because i remember seeing that at the end of the last episode i did make quite a bit more ammo i have some more coming i had to do quite a bit of uh, mining to get the coal and nitrate to get it but at least we do have that and we're getting more in so that is going to help out quite a bit or so i hope we should be getting fairly close to where we need to be. And it's right over here. All right. So this is the mortician's house. I don't know what's going to be here. This is our first tier four job. So we do have to be wary of that. Let's go take care of some of the local before we start the mission. And we have a few of them coming for us. Yay! More enemies. All right. Sounds. Somebody's trying to get in, but I'm not too sure exactly where. What are you doing up there, lady? Huh? Sweet. Did we hit you by accident? On purposeful accident, huh? Poor little dead lady. Another one? Is that your sister? Did I just take out your sister? Not to dinner. Wouldn't want to actually do that, you know. But she did look very similar to you. Except I think your sister was prettier. Hehe. <laughs> I called your sister pretty. I called your sister pretty. Pretty ugly. Actually, I really do like the new zombies and stuff that they have put in the game since. Alright. Let's go loot this bag over here that was dropped. And it's going to startle me over there. Then we will get this mission going. I'll pull over there by the exclamation and we'll start doing this. Oh, look, nice level X. I didn't mean to drop this one and I totally forgot. So we do have these things now. Sweet. Let's go to here. And we do have a lot of storage room on here. And that's going to help out quite a bit. So I'm going to drop these things. And I also, I also made a good meal. A steak and potato meal. 50 food, 25 health, and 20 max stamina bonus. So we won't run out of stamina, hopefully as quick. And that should help. Now, I also want to make sure that we do use good weapons and stuff. Mainly because we're going to be in tier 4 stuff now. Alright, everything here is loaded. Let's go ahead and start this mission. So, we have to go see what all is going to be in here. It's been a long time since we've done the mortician's house. I do remember doing it, but that was in Alpha 20, and now we're in 21. And they have made posts about Alpha 22. They have, on Facebook and stuff, they have been reworking some of the animals and stuff, so there is that. I got it. Okay, 
So we're going to go through, get all of these guys done, get everything cleared, and we also have to get the supplies. We'll do that, and then, of course, as usual, I will go back through and loot. So let me just go ahead and start getting this done. And hopefully everything goes okay here. Don't go standing in the fire. That's not good. That's not a Jimi Hendrix reference either. It could be, but it's not. Let me stand next to you, Saya. Okay. Now, we are going to be having some way tougher enemies, so that's something we're definitely going to have to look at. Let me go ahead and get this guy out. Make sure he's fully loaded. And let's go in through here and start doing this, man. Yeah, I bet that hurt. I bet that hurt. All right. Nice thing is we should have more than enough ammo, I hope. Huh. Never knew that was there. How do you like that? Ooh, hey, all right. Proofs handgun crafting skill. Ooh, drum magazine mod. Nice. That's awesome. That's going to help out a lot. To go into that room over there, but let's do this here first. Okay. Now, let's go ahead and do this. I just want to make sure to get that good stuff. That guy went kabooey. His head kind of, you know, got slightly damaged. Sounds like they're trying to rip the place up. Hey, bandolier mod. Let's go ahead and read that. Awesome. We're going to read all the books, of course, that we can. We're going to have to go through and see about all of that kind of stuff, because that's always good. There won't be anything much, hopefully, until we drop down into the lower area. But, again, we have not done this for a long time. So, I do like the mortician's house. It is hard. That guy over there scared the snotty wobbers out of me. But it isn't too terribly bad. I might go ahead and see about food and what all we need. Let's go and have the steak and potato meal. I think that'll help out a lot. Should give us a lot of health. And then we should be okay. Hey, all right. Another crafting magazine. Yay. All right. 56 of 100 for the food. We are getting close to the end of that. And then we should be okay. Okay. They're outside. Hopefully they won't be able to come in too quick. Now let's just go and try to find the enemies. Just trying to come through there. We will look at stuff like this because you never know when there's going to be good stuff in there like that. How do you like that bird right there? We were tanning on top of him. Ha <laughs> ha. Look, man, I know you really like to tear the place apart, but that's ridiculous, okay? Let's go ahead and get this bird. I didn't even know we were standing on top of the bird, and I looked down and was like, there's the bird. How do you like that, man? That's awesome. Okay. Make sure that we do check for magazines and stuff, because that's always important. You never know where they're going to be. Okay. Let's go ahead and go over here this way. Doggone it. Now we got to go back through there again, man. I don't know what's going to be in here. Let's go take a quick look. Not a whole lot that we really need. We do have a few things on us. Let's go and drop them in the bike. And then we'll get back up there again. 
This thing loads so much faster than the pipe pistol does. That's one of the best things about it. Good. All right, let's get back up through there and get back to where we were. All right, let me go see if I can get across here this time. Much better. I can put stuff down if I want to, to make it easier. But I just don't know if it's actually going to help or not. We will have to go through that window. All right, hey, another cooking magazine. Awesome. We're 57 now. We're getting close. Okay, just some steel. I want to do the trash, not the garment bag. Nothing good. At least good for us right now. And then that room, we have done this before, if you remember correctly, but it has been a while. And so there are some surprises that I'm sure we're going to have to deal with. Especially once we go down to the lower depth and all that. Good. Could have been so much worse. We're not doing too bad health-wise, so I'm not going to get too terribly worried about taking stuff we don't have to right now. Let's make sure we look. We're going to need more lead. That much I do know. And we'll have to go out that door. All right, there's another book that we have read. Wolves are common predators and are dangerous packs. Do 10% more damage to wolves. We will take that and then we'll sell it a little bit later. Let me see. Is there anything here? A tater. Don't really think we need the tater, but you know. All right, let's try to get this finished up so we can move on to the next area. Somebody's going to be back there. Of that, I am sure. All right, Forge Ahead book. Yay, 43 of 75. We're getting close to that one being done, too. I am positive somebody's going to pop up from right back there. Told you. Okay, we'll go through that door. Let's just search around here for a quick sec. Make sure everything's okay. That door's locked. We don't really need to gather up this stuff for right now. Nice squishy squishiness. Now we're headed to the depths. And this is going to be where it gets a bit more tricky. Alright, 1,200 points, huh? Sweet. Another one. Awesome. 44. Getting closer. Got to get up there and get that stuff. We will do that here in a quick sec. Not going to worry about the die. We don't need that. Because we don't need to die. Because we already have seven days to do that in. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, well, let's see if I can get up here. And now we do this careful balancing act of walking on these Dargon things and see if we can get over there somewhat safely. Let's run do this, get into here, and see what there is. Ooh, hey, that's a good pick. Heck yeah, I'm going to take that baby for sure. It's not as good as our steel one, but it's still better than that first one that we got. I 
think we had one, but I don't remember for sure. I do know we did have one. Might as well take that so we don't have to come back up. And let's just go ahead and do this as well. So that way we don't have to worry about it again. Uh, as far as I know, that's everything that's up here. Except for maybe in there. Okay. All right. Now. I do want to be sneaking. I don't know why I stopped sneaking. I hear flies somewhere. Okay. Probably because of all the, the bodies. Let's look through these, see if there's anything good. Hopefully there will be something good in one of these. Doesn't look like a whole lot, does it? Nothing that I'm too terribly worried about. Lots of taters. Let's get into here and see what this may hold. Another one, yay, 58, we're getting close. All right, I really do like the dungeon crawling thing. I think it's pretty awesome. It is hard, it is tough, and sometimes crazy, but it's always fun to me. I guess that's a bag of trash. I couldn't quite tell for sure for a minute. <laughs> Doggone lady, you scared me. Hot dog. Gave me chills all up and down my legs again. She likes to do that to me for some reason, and I don't know why. Ooh, hey, Bunker Buster Mod, sweet. Let's go ahead and read that. Get that one done, awesome. Oh, there's our courier satchel. Kind of forgot about that already. Okay, we have that, so that's part one. Can't really, I mean, we can get through there, but uh, it's not going to do a whole lot of good. Lovely body on the table, huh? Doesn't look like there's going to be a whole lot in here. Okay. Then, of course, I will come back through. I know I say that a lot. I just need to, more than anything, remind myself. Nothing really worth it. All right. Now we begin the hard part. The ascent into madness. Or the descent into madness, I guess it was. Oh boy. Okay, that is nothing. Definitely people around. If we can get back here or not. Doesn't look like it wants to let us. There we go. Just had to get in the right place. If we're going to be back here and do all this, we might as well just go and do all this right. Right? Right. Club crafting skill. We'll do that. We'll take this coal. And then we'll come back out and go around the corner and go see what the heck may be in the other room coming up. It's probably where all the bad people is going to be. But we won't know for a quick minute. Right behind that door, right over there. 
They're whispering to me. I can hear them. Come on, lady. Okay. So scary. Oh, whoa, lady. You don't want to die, do you, honey? I don't blame you, but still. Scared me again. All right, there we go. Another medical journal. We'll take that. Might as well just go and take all that stuff. I don't think it's going to hurt. Our place has been badly damaged. Wonder. Nope. Let's read these books. Sledgehammer crafting skill. Iron sledgehammer quality three. Nice. I guess we ought to work on that sometime, huh? I got it. Well, we have a drop to get at some point in time, too, now. Oh, boy. Okay, nothing down here, so now we need to just look through this. Let's make sure. Ooh, a beaker. I want to take the beaker. Yes, sir. -y. We can always use that. I think we have a couple of them, but it's always good to have more than one. You never know when you're going to need it. All right. Let's go through here. Okay. Well, we can take that and that. And maybe we just might as well go and take the honey, too, while we're at it. Alright, then we open the door, and we go through here. And down there is where all the fun really begins, and that's going to be scary. We do need gas. For our motor skickle. Shoot. Shoot! I am, I am, I am! Holy moly. Well, at least we didn't have any of the green dudes. That's good. That's for the best. I was sure we were going to... Whoa, hey, 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 hey. What are you doing? What are you doing? Don't be wasting ammo. Doggone finger. All right. This is now cleared. Let's go into this other area over here. That is the way out over here. And that way we'll open up a door. Oh, go down the steps. That will open up a door there, and then we have to dig our way out through there. We have done this. It's just been quite some time. Okay. Now I will begin looting, but let's go and see about the back area first. Make sure we have enough room. We should. And this is where all the loot is. Let's go and start getting this stuff done and get through here. Ooh, hey, vehicle crafting skill, nice, wiring 101, and the forge. All right, let's do the ammo pile. We need those, we'll take those, we need those, and we definitely need those. That will help. Nice. Let's go through here. There may be stuff beneath us, too. I don't know what's down underneath the ground, but we'll find out here in a little bit, I think, but I'm not sure. 
medical journal, and you know what I might do? Well, we'll take all that for right now. The cloth and all that stuff. Hey, vehicle crafting book and a trap crafting book and a duckbill mod schematic we read. Now we gotta open this. Since we got the, the lockpick thing opened all the way, that really does help out a lot. So we can open that on the first try. How do you like that? Burning shaft mod schematic. Good. Two of those. Awesome. Okay. We already have that. We do. We can take that. And we're going to take that to sell. That's worth 550 Cool. And then we do have quite a couple of these. So we can deal with that. And we should probably I did drink one of the other waters. I was taking up a slot, so there is that. Um, what I'm going to do is probably just put that in there for right now, and then I'll go through here. So we do have what two slots, and there's exactly two things. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go put stuff on the hey, bike. And I will continue looting the rest of this and get this stuff done so that way we have this. Before we do, though, we have to go up here and let's dig our way out of up here. So that way we have this. I know I don't have any clay on me, but that's okay. That's perfectly fine. I can gather that. And if not, no big deal. Okay. Awesome. Let's go find our bike around the back, and then I will make my way back through. Probably just revisit it all over again and gather what I can. Well, I'm about ready to finish gathering up the last of the loot here, and I noticed in these candle bras that you can get candles if you break them, which I did not know. I just had another one over there that had caskets and there's one of those on it so I'm just like okay well let me get that and the I thought well I can see what I can get out of that candle bra and sure enough I did get candles and so I thought that was pretty interesting I do like how they do that kind of stuff I think it's very very cool that they have that in there okay I think I have a couple more areas left to do. Got a dumpster in the back and a couple of other things. And then we should be done. Then we can go get our points. I did dump off everything that I could. And right now I'm just about finished up. There is a trash can or two. Still need to look at and see if there is. As far as I know, everything else here should be done, and that's good. That's going to help. Let me just go ahead and put a couple of more things on here. And then we can gather up the last of the stuff and get that done. We're so close to getting another level. At about oh, two-thirds of the way up, I'd say. Maybe more. Which is good, so that means that we're getting that much closer to... Getting the last part of what we want unlocked for the things that we're looking for, for the trader stuff. Okay, there's that. And that. We are now full, and there's also that drop over there. Let's just go ahead and get that while we're at it. And then we'll go back and see the trader. Just now getting up to there. Let's get this done. Hopefully some decent stuff. Another workstation crafting magazine. All right. Looks like we got a crafting skill magazine bundle and some wood cubes with which we can build. Awesome. All right. Not maybe the best, best stuff, but still better than nothing. Now let's head back home. Go to the trader and get this finished for today. And then we will do another one soon and get another one ready at least. So that way next time we can just come in and hopefully start getting stuff done. Got as much as I could put away and I still have a full inventory. I didn't really put a lot, a lot away, but I got enough out that we can do something now. So let's go over there. Let's get this. 
And let's hope that we can get something good. I'm hoping that we can get really close to the next level. We should maybe get up to it, but I'm not sure. Let's go find out. Let's go ask Jenny. Hi, Jen. We've How you got doing, the Jen? best prices in the wasteland. You have the only prices in the wasteland. Good job. I knew you could do it. Ooh, steel helmet, huh? Yikes. That would be awesome. That would help out so much. I am getting that for sure. All right. Can I see your inventory, please? I'm going to sell these things and get these done here. And I'm going to sell those and those. All right. So now I have a bit of that stuff sold. We now have a steel helmet. That's going to be awesome. That's Thanks for the business. 15 Stay safe one. out there. Let's do any jobs. Fetch and clear. That's going to be the closest one. If you do this for me, I will never forget you flushing rule palace all right let's go ahead and accept oh thank that. goodness i couldn't find anyone to do that job all right i don't know anything about that one i've never even heard of that one let's open up this crafting skill magazine bundle real quick all right medical journal we will read that and oh hey herbal antibiotics yay and we did not have a beaker so i put that in the campfire and handgun crafting magazine pistol quality two nice so now we can do that and sledgehammer crafting skill we got those awesome now for our helmet this is a scrap helmet it is not modified so let's go and put that baby on and let's go see all right hopefully we can find something like a water purifier mod or something that would be great if we could and then we can have we could that we can just drink the water without any problems at all and that would be pretty awesome i'm gonna harvest the garden in a minute but first i just thought i'd collect that so we have that and then i'll come back and get that in a little bit so we have a new helmet we have this awesome helmet right here and we are really close to the next level, and that's awesome. That won't take too long to do. Do a few things, and that will be done. We also have a few more bullets, so now we have almost 300 of the 7.62s. And that's always, always good. I did make a couple of changes. I put in a box there, and I put in mods over here, so we have that. And I'm probably going to have to start separating out the clothes and the armor and stuff. So that way we have things separated. Because, you know, you got to keep them separated. And now we have that. So we do have a lot of dukes. We have a lot of things happening. And we also have some candles. How do you like that? We also have some good cotton and stuff. And we have a lot of other things happening right now. So that is good. We also have got another good X, and I do like that part a lot. This is Seven Days to Die. Thank you for joining me here. If you've enjoyed the episode, drop a like on the video. We will do that one the next time at the Flushing Rule Palace, whatever that is. I have never been there, so I don't know anything about that one. And I will talk to you next time. You have a great day, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.